What's up, YouTube? Uh, today, well, you already know what the title is. That's what we're going to be talking about. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get a little breakdown for you, a little breakdown for you. But uh, before I get started, though, man, I be want, I want to do shout outs for all my new subscribers each week. But um, I guess uh, YouTube has it where if you have like a private YouTube, it doesn't really tell the person who you are when you subscribe. So I'm I'm gaining subscribers, but I can't see who you are. I guess I can, you know, go some some sort of way to go online, but through my phone I can't tell who you are. So this is what we're gonna do. If you're a new subscriber, you 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 subscribe after you saw this video. This is a uh, vlog eight, vlog eight. You subscribe after this. Comment on the the video on YouTube saying you're a new subscriber and then whatever else you want to say. But you know, just let me know you're a new subscriber. I give you a shout out. Now if you're seeing it on Facebook, just be sure to like GSP Riders. Uh, that's who's posting this right now, so you'll see that. Uh, just be sure to like. You can hit comment. You can comment on. You know, what I'm saying, let me know you're a new liker on Facebook, a new follower on Facebook, and same thing. Get a shout out for that too. let's get to the video man so i've been noticing you know the rock crawler world is changing a little bit uh you know so you're starting to see you know dogs with you know with the tail on and uh you know old school people people in america old school people in america they i even had somebody uh, write me on facebook uh shout out to him you know who he is um uh, and, and said uh yeah man when they got the tail on they look they just look like a mutt and I, <laughs> I laughed at it, but you know, that that's not the case anymore. You know what I'm saying? These dogs with tails are actually, you know, European dogs. You know what I'm saying? You can and I and I was trying to explain it to my wife. You can tell that these these ain't those little, you know, poorly bred dogs. Like these dogs are solid. You know, they solid. They have their tail, but they're solid. So you know it's not what you call. You know it's high quality. Matter of fact, it's probably even better quality than the dogs you see with their tails dog. Like it is high quality. It's coming from you know you know, what Rock Rock's, you know, breed is called the motherland because, it's, you know, it's, it's in Europe, so it's over there. Because um, in Europe, they have a law now where you can't have dog tails. Um, so, and so all their registration, all their shows and all this stuff are featuring dogs without dog tails. And if you buy a dog over there, if you purchase a dog from over there, like directly, that dog was born over there, the dog will have a tail, period. So, you know, so when I see a dog with a tail, you know, a good looking Rock Rock, we're not talking about any poorly bred Rock Rock, we're talking about I'll, I'm strictly talking about good looking purebred rock raw solid. All right, you see them with the tail, and then you're like, okay, that's a foreign, you know, that's a foreign. That's like, you know, it's like having, you know, cars, and that's a, that's a foreign car. Um, and, you know, that's a, you know, that's a quality level there. Um, but, you know, just to see, I posted up, you know, tail versus no tail, you know, to, to my people, you know, because my people were, you know, all my people are American. Um, so, you know, mostly we, all we know is duck tail and I still prefer the duck tail cause I like it. I think it makes the dog looks, uh, more solid, more tough, you know, and that's, and for, you know, rock waters, their main purpose is protect the dog. You know, they do everything now cause rock waters are, that's why they're getting so popular. They're super, they do everything. They're the super dog. I promise you the super dog, the nicest dog, the sweetest dog, the toughest dog, the strongest dog, the whatever is dog, the smartest dog, I'm, everything dog. So, um. You know, so so they're you know super getting gaining popularity, you know, literally by the second. Like, why are you watching this video? Rock Roll is getting more popular right now. So, this is uh what it came with. I'm let me show it on the screen. As you can see, <laughs> yeah, it's strongly leaning toward you know no tail. Yeah, and that's fine. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. You know, so so I just wanted to you know let people know you know what the the dogs with tails are because i'm currently my dogs in the yard right now have have a dog tail uh my future dogs may or may not have dog tails um matter of fact they won't matter of fact they won't because i'm where, where i'm heading toward um my adult dogs i mean my dogs that i purchased for me for breeding purposes um will probably have a tail on them and it's not you know it's not like like it's my preference this is what because I, I want my kennel you know so if you get a dog from gsp most of them will have a dog tail uh if you wanted to, if you want to keep the tail on you have to you know 
if you're on your my waiting list or you know it's, it's before the puppies are born you know you've already paid your deposit let me know and i will you know make sure that your know, your puppy is you know a t t puppy with the tail on but as as a whole gsp riders will have doc tails however my breeding dogs so my my dogs that were that are going to breed my stud and uh my female dogs will probably have tails cuz as as you know as i grow i'm probably going to get dogs that have tails cuz most dogs that come from europe have tails and uh breeders over here you know that breed straight um you know foreign foreign rock rollers you know rock rollers from from first great european direct because all you know all rock rollers are european or german excuse me all rock rollers are german um uh, i don't want to get into a german american serbian you know whatever dog you you can watch my previous video about that but and those are types not breeds uh what i'm, what I'm talking about shrieking is the breed you know the breed is you know originated in germany um you know it's a roman dog but originated in germany so but uh you know so europe you know, so the European look is, is you know, is motherland, really, for rock rollers. So that's what most high quality, like super high quality um, rock rollers going to look like and going to have. So I want to get that bloodline. So let me know, let me relate it, direct bloodline, because all of them have the bloodline. Um, I want to get more, you know, the direct source. So I will begin that direct source. So it probably will have a tail on it. But you can get your dog, you get your puppy, you know, true. You know, get your puppy with a dog tail from GSP Riders. Just know the mother and father uh, will probably have a tail. But they're going to look great. I guarantee you they're going to look great, tail or not. I'm an either person. So if you look at this graphic I'll post up now, that one person that said either, that's me. Because I think if the dog looks great muscle-wise, uh, head-wise, uh, fur quality, uh, color, you know, colors and stuff like that, if that dog looks great, it doesn't matter if you have a tail or not. That's a solid rock roller period but uh let me tell you what we're looking for at gsp um just a quick little say say um you know say like let's talk about it in cars because i don't want to really get into specifics of where i where bloodlines i want to get my dogs from and and create my own bloodline in a uh, long term so i don't want to you know get into specifics with you guys and let you know because everybody got their thing i got my thing but anyway so let's say cars Let's say you want uh, uh Japan. You go to Japan, you get your Toyota. You know, Toyota's always known for quality, lasting a long time. Let's say you want to go. And, yes, I just dropped the camera. My bad. Uh, like I was saying, you go to Japan, Toyota, quality lasts a long time. Um, then I want to go to, like, you know, say go to Germany where the BMWs are. Um, you know, BMWs are known to be flashy. You know, the... Up, you know the bougie the when you see it it look and smell like money you know that that brand so i want the look smell like money brand and i want the you know i might go to japan and uh grab that quality lasts a long time brand and then i come back to america and grab that uh you know the chef the chevy silverado you know american brand that rugged you know because you know say say in cars speaking of cars you know say overseas no, uh, they they don't have as much exhaust level. Their exhaust level got to be a lot lower because they're a lot greener overseas. And so America, you know, you still can have that old school seven shift right over just vroom, vroom, vroom. You know what I'm saying? Say I want the big, so I still want the vroom, vroom. You know what I'm saying? I want the last long quality and I want the, you know, the prestige of the, of the BMW. So you get all three of them and I create my own car brand. Uh, that's what I'm trying to do with the Rock Roller, man. So like I said... Won't get into the details, but you know, you might see my dogs end up with tails or not, depending on, you know, depending. You know what I'm saying? Money talk. So I might be able to, you know, finagle something where I can get the dead tail dog. But I probably won't. Because I like, you know, I like how how it looks and I like you knowing that it's, you know, it's 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 from Europe. You know, this dog is from Europe, period. I like that. So but my dogs, you know, what the bloodline I'm trying to get to will have, you know, dog tails, but you know, you know where it originate from. And now, you know, you know what I'm saying? What I'm trying to do with it as I, you know, create, you know, this, uh, perfect, you know, GSP Roddy. I know you guys going to love, you know, I know, I know it's going to be a great, you know, thing for the, the rock roller community. I know it's going to be great for rock rollers in general. You know, we just head into a nice place, man. I can see it. Like I can see it. I hope you guys can see it, man. It's going to take some time, but we headed there, man. Y'all just follow along with me, man. And I uh, appreciate y'all for watching. If you like this content and other content like this, man, make sure you like, share, subscribe, uh, follow if you're seeing this on Facebook. 
all that good stuff, man. Tell your friends, tell a friend, tell a friend, tell a friend. You know what I'm saying? If, even if they don't, you know, want to purchase a, a rock roller right now or in the, in the near future, you know, you might want one years down the road, man. Just make sure you subscribe and just keep up with me, you know what I'm saying, so I can tell you more about this wonderful breed that I think, though, I believe is one of the best dogs around. Um, You know, I just want to tell you about it, you know, so, so just, you know, follow on, on YouTube or Facebook or instagram you know i'm on tiktok too gsp riders everywhere it's gsp riders everywhere uh riders r-o-t-t-i-e-s man appreciate y'all watching bow